can do what you want to You can do what you want to do. You can be what you want to be. Just say that I believe in me. I believe in me. I believe in me. Oh. But you got to believe in yourself. And we on the front line headed to the bookshelf. We gon' chase our dreams. We gon' reach for the stars. These stars take you far. Three times is a charm. Oh, see this is a job. Reading this from the middle. Time to ring the alarm. Oh, see this is a song. Oh. You can do it. Hello, believers. Welcome to the Believe Project. My name is Mr. Anthony, and I am having a fantastic time exploring all of these great books with you. Think about this. Have you ever heard the word entrepreneur? Entrepreneur means someone who owns or starts their own business. For example, Maybe you have a great idea like cutting the grass for all the people in your neighborhood or shoveling snow for your family and friends. Or maybe you have a great recipe for making lemonade. Sometimes we think of entrepreneurs as people who are really clever and smart. Another word for clever and smart people is whiz. Our featured author today is both an entrepreneur and a whiz, and he has written the book, Biz is a Whiz. His name is Mikey Wren, and the illustrator is Donald Hill. So sit back, relax, enjoy, and listen to this wonderful story, Biz is a Whiz. But before we do that, remember, let's say our Believe Pledge. To all the believers, what do we see? Stories written for you and me. Tales of adventures and fantasies. Narrative saying, be the best that you can be. To all the believers, let's count to three. Then open your books and read with me. One, two, three. Poems by Shanti Wilson. Poems can be about many different things. They could be about jewelry and bling. They could be about happiness, sadness, anger, and madness. There's so many different things. Poems could be about dreams or all the tiny things. If you have enough imagination, you could dream about a vacation. You can write a poem anytime and all the time, and they don't always have to rhyme. It just depends on your creativity and what comes from your mind. Our deepest fear is not that we're inadequate. Our deepest fear is that we're more powerful beyond measure. It is our light, not our darkness, that most frightens us. Your plan small does not serve the world. There is nothing enlightened about strength so that other people won't feel insecure around you. And as we let our light shine, we unconsciously give other people permission to do the same. And as we're liberated from our fears, our presence automatically liberates others. My name is Mikey Wren, and I'm a 13-year-old youth entrepreneur, and I wrote a book called Business of Wiz. I want to start a business, but I don't know how. How my name is Biz, I'll show you how. Biz is a Wiz. Biz is a Wiz. First, let's start with a business plan. Get your paper and pen in your hand. Biz is a Wiz. What's your big idea? Make sure it's grand. That's a great idea. A lemonade stand. Biz is a whiz. Biz is a whiz. Don't be afraid. Who will buy your lemonade? Ask family and friends. Now let's get paid. Biz is a whiz. Biz is a whiz. Now it's time to buy lemon sugar and ice. We must not forget to check the price. Biz is a whiz. Biz is a whiz. Mix lemon sugar. 
jug of water and grab a cup. Now all this love is to put the stand up. This is a whiz. This is a whiz. So that on lemonade, count the money we made. That's a lot of change, how much can we save? This is a whiz. This is a whiz. Subtract all the costs, make sure there's no loss. Tell your friends, thanks and taking money to the bank. This is a whiz. This is a whiz. Everybody, my name is Michael Burton. Today I'll be reading Changing Seasons with my mind trees. It was a bright sunny day in Pleasant Meadow. Tanisha was excited about the first day of school. Miss Wellesby seemed excited too. Good morning, class. Today we will talk about the seasons spring summer fall and winter let's begin hello everybody my name is mercy person today i'll be reading i got the rhythm by connie morrison let's go i thought of a rhythm in my mind Think, think. I heard the rhythm with my ears. Beat, beat. I looked at the rhythm with my eyes. Blink, blink. I smelled the rhythm with my nose. Sniff, sniff. I sang the rhythm with my mouth. Ooh la la. Mama puts the comb down and rubs my hair in places. Hi, my name is Sadaya. This is my sister. I am reading my favorite book, I Love My Hair, by Natasha Tartan. The Spanish girls, then she leans in close to me like she has a big secret to tell. Do you know why you're so lucky to have this head of hair, Kiana? She asks. I shake my head no, because it's beautiful and you can wear it in any style you choose. Hey Mikey. Hey Mr. Anthony. What inspired you to write this book? Well, I wrote this book because I wanted to teach young kids about entrepreneurship. Hey Mikey. Hey Mr. Anthony. What does the word believe mean to you? Well, Believe means to me that you have faith in something or someone that you cannot see. Biz is a Wiz by Mikey Rand. Illustrated by Donald L. Hill. I want to start a business, but I don't know how. Hi, my name is Biz. I'll show you how. Biz is a Wiz. First, Let's start with the business plan. Get your paper and pen in hand. Biz is a whiz. Next, what's your big idea? Make sure it's grand. I know a great idea. We could build a lemonade stand. Biz is a whiz. Now that we know your idea, who you market to? Who will buy your lemonade? Family and friends is a great answer to my questions. Ask everyone and have courage. Don't be afraid. Let's go get paid. Biz is a whiz. 
Now to the story to buy lemon sugar and ice. We must not forget to check the price. Biz is a whiz. Pour the water, add the lemons, stir in the sugar, and grab a cup. Now we can put the stand up. People are coming from left to right. Let's fill them all up. Biz is a whiz. Finally, it's time to add the money we made, then subtract what we spent at the store. We sold out of lemonade, now it's time to make more. Biz is a whiz, and he's a whiz at Biz. Jelly by Mackenzie Mixon. Jelly, jelly. Man, I love jelly. People think it's weird, but I don't care. I love it. Jelly. By Mackenzie Adolph. The world is real. It is unique. It has its flaws, but we will never be weak. Sure, some of us are mean and make things we will never need. Yet some of us are kind to help us with whatever we need. We all wonder where it all is going to end. We all wonder how it begins. We are not perfect, even God knows that. But that is okay, because he loves us in his own little way. We all would have been A-OK -okay if the prettiest angel did not betray God. But there is always one person you should always obey. Be yourself and stay that way. Now that's the sentence where I can say A-OK. -okay. Hello, believers. Welcome back. Today is all about entrepreneurship. And so I have two great friends with me today. We all have a great business idea, and that is our lemonade recipes. And so all of us are going to share our lemonade recipes today. So our first guest is our featured author, Mikey Wren. Tell all of our believers hello. Hi, everybody. Today, you guys will be learning how to make some amazing lemonade. <laughs> All right, absolutely. See, I think he came to win, but we'll see. All right, so my other great friend here is Reverend Tracy. She is a teacher at the Sister Thea Bowman Catholic School in East St. Louis, Illinois. Say hello to our believers. Hello, believers, and I am here to make some simply amazing lemonade. <laughs> Absolutely. So this is going to be a great contest between the three of us. We'll have a lemonade test at the end, but each one of us will make our own special recipe. So I want them to kind of share with you what their recipe is. Mikey, do you want to start? Okay, so first, almost every single lemonade, you need some either lemons or lemonade mix. So that's what I got. I got lemonade mix. All right. And I have some water. And also, I have one secret ingredient, pineapple juice. All right. <laughs> I bet that will taste good. Lemon and pineapple juice. Mm -hmm. Sound like that goes together, right? Yes. Okay. Reverend Tracy, what's your recipe? Okay. I have a very simple recipe. <laughs> okay. I have lemons. I have water. And I have some lemon powder. And lots and lots of love oh, for my lemonade. Okay. <laughs> you can't beat anything that's got love. I don't know. So it looks like we got some competition, Mikey. <laughs> she put love in her. Right. <laughs> right. So here's my recipe. Um, what I have is lemon juice. I have sugar. Because you know it's got to be sweet, right? Be sweet. If the lemonade not sweet, it ain't right. And then I have my special ingredient strawberries strawberries and it's going to make this lemonade taste just right okay you guys ready to get to it let's get to it let's get to it all right all right while they're getting started i'm going to tell just a little story about um how i decided to use this particular lemonade recipe so when i was a kid my mom used to make the best lemonade. So we were part of a faith community. Mm -hmm. And in that community, we had all of these special days. So yeah. there was like the International Tea. There was Children's Day. There yeah. was Easter. Yeah. And my mom was always asked to make the lemonade for those shows. So I think I would like to make her lemonade today because it's very special. I love my mom, right. and I'm going to celebrate her today. Okay. You guys got a special story behind your lemonade? Anybody? Well, I just think that when life gives you lemons, yeah. like maybe not so good of a grade, like a C or a D, <laughs> yeah. make some lemonade. Turn that thing around. Study a little bit harder. There you go. There you go. Absolutely. That's wisdom, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Lemons are a little bit. 
But when you put a little sugar put on it, it on makes it all right. Extra makes little it, effort. I love yeah. extra little effort. Yeah. Absolutely. There yeah. you go, Reverend it Tracy. Is, yeah. All right. What about you, Mikey? I actually started a lemonade stand when I was seven. Wow. Um, everything's is off some lemonade. Okay. And it was basically this exact same recipe, but with a little sugar we sweetened to taste. With that lemonade, I made twelve hundred dollars in three days and selling just this exact same recipe. Seven years old. Wow. Yes. Seven years old. Yes. Wow. Serious. What you do with all that money? Uh, I I took my portion of the money and I invested inside of my vending machine business called okay. Mike's Monty's Vending. Awesome. That's impressive. Thank you. So, so what made you think about being a business person? I mean, seven years old, who thinks about that? Well, so I saw my mom, she was an entrepreneur, my dad, like everybody pretty much in my family was entrepreneurs and I really was money hungry. Like, I, I wanted money. Like, At I seven wanted years money. old. Yes, like, I what, really, you, like, what were you trying to buy with? Like toys. I would want like toys and my mom, she was like, um, you gotta either earn it through allowance or figure out another way to get some money. Okay. So okay. I was like, Well, what if um Actually, I was watching uh, Channel Nine. Okay. When I heard that okay. I, uh, about entrepreneurship, the show uh, Biz Kids. Okay. Oh, yes, okay. I was actually watching that show. Okay. So Channel Nine is the PBS station, mm -hmm. right? Yes. Okay. Cool. Where are we with our uh, lemonade making? Are we almost there? Everybody's yes. almost there. Pretty ready. much. Yeah. <laughs> pretty pretty yeah. much. Yeah. Okay. I think uh, we're ready to serve it up. Everybody's ready to serve it up. Serve it we're going to use, yes. everybody's going to get a cup of each other's lemonade, and we're going to see who has the best lemonade taste. All right. Let's see here. Wallop, wallop, wallop. <laughs> wallop. Here we go. Okay, we ready? We're ready. Mike, you ready? Yes. So I'll get one to Mike, one to Reverend Tracy. Thank you. One to you. Thank you. One to I. Mm -hmm. Lemonade genius over there. And here you go. Thank you. All right. Thank okay. You. So who we want to go with first? Who we want to taste? Let's go with yours first. Okay. okay. Taste mine first. Okay. Let's see how it is. And I'm thirsty. <laughs> mm. What wow. you think? This is really that's good. That's good. Supposed to be jumping up and down. That's, but that's jump, good. Jump, jump. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> that's really it's good. Really, yes, okay. it's actually Thank really, you. really good. Good. I got a thumbs up. All right, let's try Reverend Tracy's. Let's see how that is. This is the right way. Oh my God! Mm -mm. I taste the lemon mm -hmm. and the pulp okay. and the lemonade yeah. it gives it that mm -hmm. extra kind of like kick. Okay. Excellent. Yes, Excellent. It's really Excellent. good. Really good. Thank All you. right. Okay. Shall we try Mikey's? Yes. All right, Mikey. We're gonna make twelve hundred dollars with <laughs> with this lemonade. It's good. It's very good. This is good. <laughs> and I taste that special ingredient, that yes. pineapple and that lemon came together mm -hmm. quite nicely. Very nice. Thank you. Would you say so? Ooh, yes. Awesome. I think we're going to give the win to Mikey. I think so. I think he has the uh, better one. I and no, and notice how I said it was, I didn't add any extra sugar. <laughs> I didn't add okay. any extra sugar. I Absolutely. used the lemon good. He was being really healthy. Believers, thank you for being with us today. I hope you had a lot of fun. We had a lot of fun. Remember, this is all about entrepreneurship. It's all about having a great idea for a business. It's all about being clever and smart. And remember, people who are clever and smart, we call them a whiz. So we'll end with this. I believe when you believe, all of your dreams can come true. See you next time. Have a good one. Heritage is our communal past, love that last, legacy, family, tradition, jubilation, celebration. I have a heritage. You can do what you want to do. You can be what you want to be. You can be what you want to be. I believe in me. I believe in me. I believe in me. Oh. What you gotta believe in yourself, and we on the front line, headed to the bookshelf.
We gon' chase our dreams, we gon' reach for the stars These thoughts take you far, three times as a charm on See this as a job, reading this from the middle Time to ring the alarm on, see this as a song, uh.